I mean, there isn't much content here, but at least God Shallot is is finally here. Can, how do I how do I change the art? How, how do I change you? There we go. So yeah, as I was saying, <laughs> there isn't much content here, but at least uh, at least God Shallot is finally here after uh, about five times longer than he should have been, than he should have taken. Um, let's see what we got here. So. This is the first shallot upgrade. Uh, th these are the first. This is the first time that a shallot upgrade mission d did not net you one thousand crystals. So, ah, uh, what? <laughs> How? What? Why? To hell with you! Like genuinely, why do you people do this? <laughs> We got more of these chance time tickets. Chance time two. Because, uh, sure, why not? Um, did... Did... Who who won chance time one? <laughs> like, who, who, won, who won the first chance time batch? They added this exchange shop where you could use whatever chance time tickets you got. This exchange shop is complete whack. There's literally nothing good in here. <laughs> Like, like, act, like, genuinely, this, this exchange shop is whack as hell. Um, I mean, let's see, what else did they add? They added a, quote, anniversary, uh, choice battle. Though, the only thing that makes it an anniversary choice battle, I'm, I'm guessing, is the fact that you can get the anniversary tickets out of it, because... Hell, the, the Goku one gave you more crystals because of the whole, you know, 59 thing. So that one actually gave you more crystals than this one does. And just better rewards in general. So I guess I guess those anniversary tickets are really the only thing that makes it an anniversary uh, choice battle. They brought Ginyu Goku back finally. And they actually brought the Goku Black event back, which... I mean, I'm not that upset about because it allows me to get an S rank of Vegeta's Platinum Equipment. But, uh, the new players got a lot of stuff to do. Us old veteran players who have already gotten God Shallot because, you know, they only added, like, five stages. <laughs> we literally waited almost an entire extra week just for, like, five more stages, but it's fine. Um... Yeah, that, that, that's it. Literally all, literally all there is now is God Shallot, which I knew wasn't going to be much content, but I was expecting a couple crystals out of it. Got no crystals out of it. Just got basic story mode crystals. Um, you can now use that whack-ass chance time exchange shop. And there's a normal choice battle. It's not an anniversary choice battle. It's just a normal choice battle. There's... Nothing special about it to warrant the anniversary title on it. So... You know... Remember that video I made about Rhyme's video yesterday? I still... I, I, I don't think there is any more of a perfect way to describe this anniversary than what he said as just calling it a regular ass month in Dragon Ball Legends. That's all this anniversary is. It's just a regular ass month. In Dragon Ball Legends. <laughs> um, yeah, so we act we actually got less crystals than I than I was expecting. I love how every single time I try to, you know, give this game the benefit of the doubt in some way, they always find a way to just prove why you should never give the Dragon Ball Legends team benefit of the doubt and why you should always expect the uh, least amount possible. They they do nothing but prove that you should you should always expect the lowest possible uh, effort. <laughs> oh, and they they added they added a couple filler banners too. I, I suppose they got the what Legend Saiyans is no Super Saiyans and then Normal Saiyans, aka Broly and Goku. So yeah. Uh, don't know what the hell this is supposed to be then, but whatever. <laughs> uh, yeah, 
I was hoping that I'd be making, you know, a longer video talking about all the great things that they added in this update, but I can't really do that. The only, quote, content they added was story mode. That's it. Um, today's second video will probably be using God Shallot in PvP. I'll probably be, I'll be using this team right here. And, um, yeah, I'll, thank, thank God I didn't stay up for this. Like, genuinely, I don't, I don't stay up for, for things in Dragon Ball Legends anymore. Like, last year's anniversary, I was up. I was up until four in the morning. Now, I, I wake up at around four or five o'clock in the morning. Like, I go, I go to bed at like 11 midnight and I wake up at around four to five. And then I, I go ahead and see what's going on in Legends. Before, I would stay up until, until like, 4 or 5 in the morning just so that I could, you know, have the jump on what's going on in Legends. But, like, when, like when uh, Super Saiyan 3 Shallot came out, I was literally, my, my, I was literally the first person on YouTube to post a video about him. Super Saiyan God, I'll probably be the last because I just, I just don't care anymore. There's nothing to do in the game. I, like, it, it took me, what, 15 minutes to complete all of the content that we've been waiting a week for? Well, really two weeks for in terms of Shallot himself, but... I mean... Yeah. I guess I'll just get out of here now. Uh, peace.